America, a country built on ingenuity, hard work, and the will of man to have a better life. It is home to some of the world's largest companies such as General Electric, U.S. Steel, and IBM, all of which started in a time period called the Golden Age. It was these companies who made groundbreaking innovations who drove our economy to rise to the top of the world. The Gilded Age was a time of innovation where inventors such as Edison, Bell, and Morse immortalized their names in the history. To discover the Gilded Age, we must go back to the Industrial Revolution. The Gilded Age began with the Industrial Revolution and was a time of technological innovation. The Industrial Revolution was a time of great change for America. We changed from a more of an agrarian society to that of a modern industrial society. It lasted from the 1820s to about the turn of the century. We saw great improvements in technology such as the telegraph, the railroad, the Erie Canal. All these things were built in this time. Along with these innovations, the Industrial Revolution brought technological advancements in oil drilling, coal mining, and the steel making process. Yeah, actually, uh, Andrew Carnegie came into Pittsburgh in the uh, 1870s to start a business uh, called uh, Carnegie Steel. And he, used, he did this uh, using the Bessemer process, which Henry Bessemer, he came up with the idea of injecting air into uh, molten pig iron. And what that did, it, it made steel. And hence the uh, Pittsburgh Steelers. At 1959, I would drag dog up the far soul well. This was the beginning of the world's oil hunger. In 1963, the Standard Oil Company was founded, and they held a strong monopoly on kerosene by holding a vertical and horizontal integration. Along with other technologies, coal mining technology was innovated during the Gilded Age. My ancestors were coal miners during the Gilded Age. Coal mining during this era was very dangerous because there were frequent cave -ins, poor ventilation, and mining would sometimes cause underground gas to leak into the mines. In the later years of the 1800s, coal cutting machines came into use. This made coal mining more productive. Building a railroad to the Pacific Ocean was not an easy task. It took a lot of labor and workforce. So employers of this looked overseas to get Chinese workers who were cheap and disposable at that time. Over 6,000 Chinese immigrated to America to work on this technological innovation that was the railroad. Transcontinental Railroad um, was first called Pacific Railway, but it was later called the Overland. It stretched from Iowa to San Francisco and was established in 1869. It was very controversial at the time because it went over many Indian territories. Um, you see, Indian relations with the Americans is like this dollar. But you take that dollar and you burn it, the relations are gone forever! Because of trains, designated time zones had to be created. This was because sundials were used to keep time, but they were very inconsistent when trains traveled across long distances. The air brake, invented by George Westinghouse, was a major innovation in safety in train travel. The Gilded Age brought about many inventions, including the typewriter, cash register, and the Gillette Razor. Hey, one of the coolest things they invented down in the Gilded Age, hey, is the Gillette Razor. King Gillette, yeah, he invented it uh, about late 1890s, but, you know, it helped with hygiene, so the bugs they ain't hiding in their hair anymore. Actually, in 1884, the Home Insurance Building was built, and that was a 12-story uh, skyscraper, which was uh, really rare for its time because it was only, most of them were only uh, six floors high. Uh, and this was, able, uh, this was able to happen because of the improvements in steel. Um, this caused also a uh, skyscraper boom in Pittsburgh, New York, and um, Chicago. In 1889, IBM created the first electric tabulating machine. I mean, I would know because I've seen them in my shop before. But in 1890, the first time it was used on really mass production was the U.S. government used it uh, to help calculate the U.S. Census. <laughs> Another important invention of the time was the Kodak camera. Actually, in 1884, uh, George Eastman came up with uh, the Kodak camera. It was kind of the first inexpensive camera to the public, and it used a uh, roll film. 
I guess that's kind of what led to the cameras like this. Another great invention of the time was the cash register. It was invented in 1879 by a guy named James Ray. The reason he invented it was because his employees were beginning to become way too dishonest. They were stealing money and they couldn't be trusted. So he invented this machine that would keep the money closed up and it would only be open when a transaction was made. First commercially successful typewriter was invented in 1868 by Americans Christopher Scholes, Carlos Glidden, and Samuel Sullivan. The typewriter was important because it became the most practical way to start writing at home. One of the coolest things they invented in the uh, Gilded Age, hey, fountain pen. They invented in the 1880s, you know? That's the coolest thing. I mean, now they got a modern one. Hey, watermen at work, they were two biggest manufacturers. The inventors, Morse, Edison, and Bell, made discoveries that changed America and the world. Sammy Morse, who's a young writer, created the first electric telegraph in 1937. This telegraph uses the coding system that Morse created along with some help. It uses dots and dashes as numbers to represent the English alphabet. I have not failed. I've just found 10,000 ways that won't work. Thomas Alva Edison was one of the greatest inventors of all time. Thomas Edison also made the first modern day lab where many people came together to invent. Edison's lab in Menlo Park, New Jersey invented such inventions as a phonograph, the motion picture camera, the incandescent light bulb, and AC power. Alexander Graham Bell made a huge leap in communication technology. Alexander Graham Bell, the inventor of the photophone and the metal detector, invented the telephone in 1876. When he invented this, this started the phasing out of the telegram. One could say that our modern day technology was built during the American Gilded Age through the pioneer inventions of Henry Bessemer, Samuel Morse, Alexander Graham Bell, and Thomas Edison. Our country was able to build her skyscrapers, cell phones, modern communications, electricity, and massive movie productions. Mark Twain coined the term Gilded Age and meant under the flourishing wealth and big business, there was poverty, grief, and serious social problems. This may be true. However, one thing is for sure, that the technology invented during this time was not gilded.